All right, everybody, welcome back to another live stream. Today we're gonna play some Green Mario Kart 8 Deluxe. Should be fun. Should be exciting. Nutella, how's it going? Welcome back. Ollie, welcome back. Hopefully, both still had a good weekend so far. Uh, all right, online play. We'll do a quick warm up. Just a nice quick warm up match. Of all the items. Let's see, 200, normal, custom, four. Yeah, I wish you can kind of have two. Josh, how's it going? Welcome back. Hopefully you had a good Saturday. Uh, yeah, just real quick. Nice warm up. Ollie, glad you can make it to the, uh, I don't know, what is this? A squad? Group? Thing? Thing we have going on here? Party? Lunar, how's it going? Welcome back. Hopefully you're still having a good weekend. I'm just gonna go random. Alright. <laughs> Already, uh... Why, why in the... I guess the warm-up's not bad, but like, why that track? Why that course? Why did I bring it up? <laughs> Tatsu, really? Why? I could just leave right now. Is it Isai? It's Isaya, right? Isaya with the $2 worth of ramen. Thanks for the donation, man. Appreciate it. Hopefully, even though there's this map that I'm now playing and there's multiple daisies around me, you're enjoying the stream somehow. Also, welcome. Hopefully you had a... Uh, Hopefully you had a good start to your weekend, unlike the start I'm having right now with this. Why, why am I getting nothing but red shells? Well, why did I pick? No, no, no. This wasn't me who picked Baby Park. No, it was not. You don't need to lie. I didn't mean to throw that. I can't believe this is the first. Oh, this is like the first race of today. Uh, it's not over yet. Why isn't it over yet? Why is there a bullet bill? Oh my god. I was so close. Alright. Let the record show I was... I misused the, uh, the, the mushroom there. Could have waited. Honestly, was hoping it'd be a red shell. When I spammed it. Insidious, how's it going? Welcome back. Even welcome back. Hopefully both had a good Saturday. Two daisies and baby park. Dude, it's just like... Help. <laughs> you need to help me, man. I need it. How's my night going? Uh, oh, how's my night so far? So far, it's not too bad. Uh, for the past, like, few hours, I've been yelling at my screen because of trying to figure out code stuff, but... Other than that, I feel like I've gotten nowhere, so maybe do more of that tonight after the stream. Light Blue Yoshi, how's it going? Welcome back. All right, the home advantage. I got this. And other toads, we got this. Tatsu, honestly, if I banned you from everything for normalizing Baby Park, you'd probably deserve it. Yeah, I'd say so. I don't know if it's that normalized yet, but, um, you know, as long as you know. <laughs> As long as you know. Why are there two? There's just a garden already. It's not good. Oh, can I throw this? Banana. No, I don't think it hit anyone. How did I miss the items? Okay, we're good. We're fine. False alarm. Oh, what, what an item. Wait, what, what happened to myself?
Oh my, how many buses are there? There was so many. Chris, you really throw red shell behind you like that? Did you really do that? All right, that was one of the dumbest ideas I've ever done. Yep, I deserve that, that's fine. No, why did you steal the mushrooms I had? All right, you know what? I'll take two seconds in a row. That's fun. It's all a warm up. It doesn't matter. Why am I the only one who doesn't have like a pair in this race? Why? Yeah, there was a long line of just like bus after bus for like a while. It was weird. Wait, are we tied? Am I tied? Wait, which one's the real me? Do I have the light eyes or the blue of the blue eyes? I don't even know. I can't even, I don't have a picture of like my me to really kind of look at. Oh, I guess it's the lighter of the blue. Okay. I'll never remember. Wayne City is you're not you're not here to help me? What? Wait, how did I Oh wait, was that the drift? Kind of looked like I ran into a mushroom. Oh my god. You guys are just gonna bully toad around. You're conflicted? That's not good. You don't like Baby Park, but you like... You like Daisy? What? How? How is that possible? Did she not really annoy you in the other game? Oh my god. Blue Shell, really? Oh my god. Why did all of that just happen at once to me? Guys, Toad's, Toad's not feeling too well. Where are these bananas coming from? Who's doing this? They are a better place than I've ever seen. No way. Did I pass someone because they hit the post? I actually don't know. In cities, what if eventually you have Alzheimer's? Or Alzheimer's? However it's called. Daisy's honestly looking out for us so we never forget. No, I don't think so. I don't need to know anyone's name. Alright, I can forget them all. That's fine. All right, another home advantage. Will it work? Please, game. For the warm-up cup. Splatoon 3 is still a very sweaty game? I guess. I mean, I never liked that, uh, that term sweaty. I feel like it's only an excuse for losers to use. Because it's like, if you're not playing the game all out, are you really not, like, you know, 
Why wouldn't you try your best in the game? It's like people who call each other tryhards. It's like, I mean, why aren't you trying as hard as you can at the game? I feel like it's just, it's an immediate excuse. Oh my god. Oh my god. Times two. Red shell, please. Just wait for like a second. That didn't work. Insidious, you need a sad comic where the last line is a woman closing the door behind her with a soft smile saying... Wait, why? Yo, can that be done? No, I, I'm not even going to entertain the idea. Wow, that bomb did not fly as far as I thought it would. And Josh, I would like to imagine anyone playing usually any game, especially a seemingly competitive game would like, you know, give it their all, right? All right, the warm-up cup. Good job, everybody. Tatsu with the first. I'm tied with Chris. We both got second. With 18 points. And Josh, how to... Wait, how, how do I rarely stream Splatoon 3? You just returned to it after not playing since October? Well, I mean, I'm just... I'm kind of fed up with, uh... <laughs> with some of the controls after, you know... Years of playing the game, and it's just like... They're not... They're not really doing anything else with it. It's like, why... Why am I gonna continuously put up with this? Also, tri-color now? Any team could be defending in the middle? It's like... Does that kind of mean all the other past tri-color... Uh, Splatfest second halves, like, were just unfair? Because, I mean, if the middle team is supposedly defending, and if that's the worst spot, and there was no disadvantage in the first half, then, like, that's pretty uneven throughout the entirety of the spot. Anyway, like, I just... That game is... Oh. Anyway, what are we doing? Six races. Custom items, 200cc. Actual random items, because Nintendo can't. All right, game. Let us know. Which of the items do we have? Which are they? It's gonna be randomly eight to something. All right, that's what we got. Doesn't look too bad. There's the bullet. That's nice. Coin. You know, maybe stop anyone from just sitting into first for too long. It might be good. How many are here? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, nine. Oh, okay, there we go. Also, Josh, did you just return to Splatoon 3 for the Splatfest? There were other Splatfests in between now and then, right? Since you last played it? Oh, what a snipe. Alright. I didn't realize I still had the red shell. I thought it'd be gone. Insidious, I had to do it. I'm sorry. <laughs> Wait, why aren't you? Oh my god, that was like three seconds delayed. Y 
You were there for like 10 seconds in front of me. It's just like, I, you just, you have nothing. I had to do it. All right, I guess I'm going this way now. Oh, Josh, you just missed the previous event. Okay. How did you miss me? What? Oh, you know what? I wonder how queuing is in the last half of Splatfest. Like, I guess if you queue with... Can, if you can queue with four people, then you're probably always going to get middle. What is my favorite Mario Kart map of this game? Because they're right in front of me and I can remember them easier. Uh, there is Cloud Top is good. What else? Thwomp Ruins is good. Yoshi Circuit's good. Super Bell Subway, Neo Bowser City. Uh, SNES Rainbow Road, Grumble Volcano. What else do we have? Ninja Hideaway, Mushroom Gorge, Boo Lake. Those are all top tier. Mars, how's it going? Super Bowl, welcome to the stream. Thomas, welcome back. Hopefully you all had a good weekend so far. <laughs> Was it worth it, Lunar? Was that shell worth the train? <sighs> Dude, I can never drift that train. It's hitboxes wild. Petition for Lunar to stream Nickelodeon version of Smash? I mean, I... But Smash already exists. It would probably be fun to play, like, a little bit, but, like, worth buying and then, like... I mean, like, I barely play Smash as it is. Justin, welcome back. You think I should uh, definitely stream Nickelodeon All-Stars? I don't know. It, it, it's just a Smash clone, right? Like, I think that's cool and awesome, but, like, to play it? I don't know. Oh, why am I drifting this way? Oh my god, I've forgotten this map. Where am I? Who am I? How did I miss the item again? Oh my god. It's tragic. How did you hit me with the fire? Are you kidding me? Mars? Do they have homing? There's like no good way to set up for this turn. Nutella, do I think I'll ever make, uh, gameplay videos? Gameplay videos. Uh, I don't know what I would do. Like, what, what would I do in a, uh, do you have an idea of what I would do in a gameplay video? Ooh, Mars, someone got gotcha. you. I wonder who it could have been. Anyone, really. Probably not me. Nope. Actually, gameplay could cover a lot of things, right? Before this, there's a channel I had where I did a lot of tutorial stuff. Gameplay-related tutorials would be kind of neat, like... This is how you SBLJ in Super Mario 64. Etc. Nutella, you don't know actually? Like a video of me playing a horror game? See, I don't ever get jump scared. Or scared of like, uh, horror related stuff. I just play the game and be like, oh there he is. Alright, I'm about to get got- I got got. Alright, let's try and do that again, but different. That's pretty much how it would go. <laughs> Wait, Insidious, I used the horn on you after you chose to... After you chose to use Toad to help you out? Wait, was that at the very beginning? That got you? 
Out of like everyone else there? It did? Oh my god. <laughs> That's great. At least it was at the uh, very beginning of the game and not like, you know, Mario Karted. I'm surprised I got anyone. Oh, the drifting just... It's so nice in this game. I've somehow actually missed this after not playing it for a full day. Talk to the tour maps are about as confusing as driving through the cities in real life. Yeah, probably just as dangerous too. Alright. Levi, you didn't, you didn't have to do that. How rude. Isaiah, I had to do it. You're playing as Daisy. That is unacceptable. <laughs> you had <laughs> insidious. There's, there's no way. You'd... All right. I thought you'd definitely have a blocker at least. <laughs> also, you like my other red shell? <laughs> oh man. I don't know who I actually hit there or who I didn't. Go, 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 come on. Oh, that wasted so much time. No. Are we gonna pass anyone? Alright, we passed one person. Great. I mean, I guess I get what I deserve. That's fine. I'll allow it. Yep. Why can't it just be the golden mushroom first? Wait, Insidious, I passed you on the long road? Wait, which road? The straightaway? Ollie, have a good one. Thanks for stopping by. I thought you said Daisy wasn't real. Daisy's not real. I don't know what character that is, but it had to go. All right. When will the next Mario Kart stream be? Uh, Maybe tomorrow. If I do stream tomorrow. I don't really have a plan to like... I, my stream schedule, this is like my default thing now. It's Princess Daisy. <laughs> Like, I really need to start looking ahead in time to see, like, when some games are coming out. That'd probably be a good idea. Alright, first place! Pretty cool. No one bothered me. No one hit Toad. That's rude. I meant to grab another item. I'm dumb. I'm experimenting way too much with that turn. That's not great. Oh, the double red. All right. Oh, no. Be gentle, please. Oh, too close. Would I ever stream Monster, uh, Monster Hunter Rise? I know nothing about Monster Hunter. I know it's like a game <laughs> where... Uh, I guess you just fight big enemies with, uh, people. They could join, something like that. Isn't it, like... 
Is it like somewhat online? Like a game that's like just like an MMO, but not really? Mars, you played that once, never touched it again. Is there a reason? An Insidious, uh, kinda, yeah. See, I never understood, like, it seems like an MMO, but, like, you only have a small party. I guess, like, Fantasy Star. Jacob, how's it going? Welcome to the stream. Hopefully you had a good Saturday. Hard to describe, but it's single player and online. Yeah. I mean, it looks like fun, but... I don't know. I just, I have no interest to really pursue it, I guess. MMOs are, um, pretty, uh, pretty good time sinks. Like, I'm pretty sure that game is, you know, probably take longer than a, uh, your typical, like, single-player game, right? That could have been anyone in Sidious. Let's just... Let's not jump to conclusions. That may be true or not wrong. <laughs> there can only be one toad. <laughs> oh, you know what? I need to see time, uh, time trials on this map. Because this map is... Again, a, a map I just do not understand. Oh no. Daisy, what are you doing? Please go away. Why have you saved all of that fire? That would be why, huh? Alright. that turn right there is just super annoying. And there's probably a better way of doing that. Oh my god. Also this turn here. Which one of us didn't get a star, huh? Josh, would I ever return to Animal Crossing New Horizons? Probably not. I don't... I don't know. What's the... Like, that game just turns into a 45-minute daily routine. And then it's like, what else am I supposed to do after that? Spend all that time editing my town? It's like, I'd rather... Just not do that. I don't know. It's... I wish there was more stuff you could do. I kind of wish you could do combat in that game. Make it like Stardew Valley. Because at least... I don't know, I could see myself spending a hundred hours trying to like find some stupid good item in like a underground cavern or something. Tattoo the time trial for this map is honestly one of the most fun. It looks wild. I don't know about fun, but maybe it is. Depending on what they do. Well, 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 who was that in front of you? Could have been any toad. <laughs> Could it have been any toad? New Leaf was so much, uh, better. Is that the... Which one was Wii versus 3DS? I know the one that had a town was pretty cool. Uh, but I think everything for Animal Crossing just eventually... Oh, New Leaf was, um, 3DS? What was the end game in there? Like, Animal Crossing doesn't really have a good end game. And if you miss an item in a season, you gotta wait a year, so it's like... I don't know how I feel about that. That's kind of lame. Josh, you put way too many hours in New Horizons? Can I not get my items? Why? What is wrong with the item thing? Am I not spamming it enough? Yeah, I could just change the clock. 
But I thought something bad happens when you actually change the clock. Or does it not matter? Wait, the boxes took my red shell? What? Also, again, it still seems like there's a missing um, end game that you could just keep doing. Like for Mario Kart, you could just keep playing the game and keep getting better and better at it. Animal Crossing, once you've collected everything and you have your villagers, like what's the... That, that's like it, right? Nutella, you're spectating? Hopefully you enjoy the, uh, the races. Oh, Insidious, yeah, I used the horn there in the, in the sky. I didn't, I wasn't actually trying to go for you. Although, Insidious with the first, uh, is that pronounced Geo King? With the second, Levi with the third, nice. Third by one point. Could have tied. Okay, that wasn't a bad item pool. That was actually decent. Jose, welcome to the stream. Hopefully you had a good weekend so far. Friend code is in the description below. And there's also a command. Feel free to join if you would like. If you dare, I mean. And if there's room. <laughs> Alright, what do we got for the next item pool? We're not how's it going? Welcome back. Hopefully your Saturday was good. Oh, this is... This is going to be interesting. Alright, that's a good one. Changing your date slash time to time travel uh, does mess up your play activity, though. Uh, done it before when building your villagers' houses and messed it up... Oh, messed up your play activity? Oh. Wait, like, in what specific way? In cities, you are the true toad. You'll wipe out anyone who isn't a toad or toadette. Okay, as long as you're not the only one allowed. We're fine, then. Oh, Mars, yeah. I, like, I'm trying to think. The last couple races, or the last race, it seemed like the item was taking a while. I don't know if that was just me or the item. I usually do spam it until a certain point, and then it will immediately just give me an item. But, uh, I don't know what was happening there. Josh, whatever you played wouldn't show it. Uh, oh, wouldn't show it would show all the way instead of up for a while. I don't know what that means. Come again? What, what is it? What does it do? Yeah, is there like a weird item lag going on? That's great. Love Nintendo. Aren't they great? Okay, the item lag here seems fine. Tatsu, you quit the lobby to give others a chance? Yeah, if you do play for a while and if people are trying to get in, just, you know, keep that in mind. I will say, these are pretty great items. Tanker, how's it going? Welcome back. Hopefully your weekend's been going good so far. Oh, Renato, what do I like to eat for breakfast? I just have like a, a simple granola bar and that's about it. Oh my god. Can we not try and hit the toad, please? Alright. 
I don't get a bullet bill or anything. I'm just stuck. Take that, Kakashi. Take that, Insidious. Take that, everyone else I passed. Is it pronounced Hassan? If not, I do apologize. But uh, welcome to the stream. Hopefully you had a good new year, uh, good new year as well. Oh, and Tanker, yeah, I have no hope for uh, Splatfests. It's like, now they're just doing random team, gets in the middle of the tricolor. It's like, so that kind of defeated the whole purpose of all the other ones beforehand. It's just, it's a mess. Josh, it would slow down and, uh, wait, it would, hold on. It would slow down and, and not to the top and sometimes wouldn't be on there for a while. This was in 2020. It happened to you. I still don't know what that means. Like the game would slow down? Tricolor is confusing. I mean, now it's better because like the first half, there was no actual disadvantage to any of the teams. It was only by player count, which is like too bad, so sad, popularity, blah, blah, blah. But like in the second half, whichever team is winning, they'd put in the middle, which would give them a disadvantage. So it's like, it's just the whole thing was like dumb. So I don't know what they're doing now. Wait, Hassan, you enjoyed, uh, SmackDown AEW Rant? Is that, like, wrestling or something? That is my best guess. Renato, you asked your friend about, uh, Splatfest, and he just, uh, oh, he just said it's okay, but some teams are weird. Not me, may fr your friend said? Some teams are weird? I mean, a team is just a team. I don't think anything really matters other than they're just a different team. Not, how's it going? Welcome to the stream. Hopefully you had a good weekend so far as well. I'm just... Over the, over the what, five years of playing Splatoon and they can't improve it for the controls for non-motion? I just... I don't know, it kind of bugs me. Not you did? That's good to hear. So glad it's still, uh, you know, first day of the weekend, not uh, the second day. But then tomorrow it's going to be like, uh, it's already almost over. How did you not get hit? How did I get hit? All right, I still got second. We're fine. It's all good. Josh, know the games would show all the way at the bottom of your play activity uh, on your account instead of at the top. Oh, I don't, I don't know if that matters or does anything. Also, give me a sec. Let me let me accept the requests. Yeah, Tanker. Now any team could be in the middle, so there is a chance that same team in one match for tricolor. Wait, what do you mean by same team? Now it's just all random and now no one has an advantage or disadvantage. Oh my god, please. T take forever, game. Nintendo. Thanks. Yeah, Tanker, it's random now. I mean, I think that's better because like, again, if you're in the middle, you'd be at a disadvantage because you were a team winning for the first half. But like, I'm, I'm curious to know what's going to happen if you queue up with uh, more than two players. Are you just always going to be in the middle? Renato, you're playing Animal Crossing on Switch. Ask you play Mario Kart. What? 
I mean, hopefully you're having fun playing Animal Crossing, but I'm not playing Animal Crossing. Nope. Not since someone stole my space parka. It's gone forever. I don't know what happened to it. Did I even get it back? Who knows? It's gone. Would have been better if it was three squads instead. Yeah, I mean, they should have absolutely have done that. I don't know why. I mean, there, there's obviously some limitation for eight players. But... I mean, I don't know. Make special maps that are like three-sided or something, you know? That's all you have to do. And then make it 2v2v2 or like somehow... Maybe just add figure out how to add one more player for 3v3v3 oh well or not to, I don't know what you mean I own both of the games I just don't want to play Animal Crossing that game just ends up being a daily game for no um there's like no end game to it there's like no return Tanker, so it's still unfair, but fair in a way because it's unfair for all? Yeah, it's absolutely fair because it's random. If it is really random. And that's better than what it was, uh, previous Splatfests. Oh, the shirt. No, I don't care about the shirt. I care about the point. It's the principle that matters. The winning team can be an attacking, which gives them a chance of winning even more points. That's fair. I mean, if the winning team, like, there's no advantage or disadvantage. Other than if, like, more of the better players are on the, are on one team. That's too bad, so sad, you know? Yeah, Insidious, I read it as that as well. Are there any spots open? I don't think so. Maybe over time there will be? I I have no idea. Mars, you get what I mean with Animal Crossing? Once you collect everything or uh, what you want, there isn't much to do uh, to show off your island. Your, oh wait, to show off, but to show off your island. See, I don't care about showing off islands. I mean, I've seen a lot of the things back in the day of like people had like an amazing built island but it's like I don't want to go through the pain to do that I would rather do that in like a 3d editing program before doing it in like the game <laughs> it's like why actually build in Minecraft when I could just use MC edit or whatever programs are used nowadays it's like that's just so much effort and work I just I can't be bothered and again for what I just there's just like nothing I'd want to continuously keep doing except like the 45 hour or 45 minutes a day dailies. But then once you collect everything, you don't even have to do that. You're done. So how's it going? Welcome back. Hopefully you had a good weekend so far. And I'd say it's going eh, pretty well. Kind of stuck on coding some stuff earlier today, but I'm just... I'm trying to clear my mind of that and maybe work on it later tonight. Can these red shells hit each other, please? Thank you. Perfect timing. All right, no one, no one hit Toad. Toad is off limits. He's a good. Oh no, he's dead. <laughs> he's dead. He died. How are you gonna bullet bill all the way past first like that? Toad's your favorite? Toad is just the best in the game. Robo Gaming, how's it going? Welcome back. Hopefully, you had a good Saturday. Other than that one blue shell, that was. That was pretty calm up there. Tanker, you're heading out to do some Splatoon 3 story mode since you're having more fun doing that than Splatfest. All right. Have a good one. Thanks for stopping by.
<laughs> it was literally war back there. It looked, uh, it looked wild. Who left those bananas at the end? It wasn't me. I threw green shells, so... If those got anyone, then... I mean, you should look out for those. They'll get you. Oh, you know what? Dry Dry Desert might be an interesting time trial to look at. There's always the ending bit, and it's like, I don't know what you're supposed to do there. Cut across, maybe? Not cut across? What is my least favorite track? Uh, Baby Park, worst track in the game. But everyone knows that. Music Park is, uh... Bad. What else is bad? Oh, TikTok Clock. These are all on 200cc as well. 150, they work, uh, Music Park and TikTok Clock work a lot better. Other than that, I really just, I don't think I'd put any other track in another category except for, like, just not my favorite. Josh, you know I love Baby Park and Daisy? I don't know what you're talking about. You talking to another Lunar? Because there's, like, multiple others in here. Can I just grab an item in peace, please? Why did I hit the thing? Oh my god. It really is war. This item set is brutal. Which is interesting, I guess. Come on, can I please get a star? I just got bananas! That's not a star. Oh my god. The double first. I'll take it. That's fine. <laughs> Wait. Am I in first? Has it really been that bad? <laughs> Has everyone really just been Mario Karted this entire time at least once? What? I had a crazy lead before. It was that much? What? I got double first and I'm still in first. See, I just assume whenever I look at the, the, uh, the Mies down there like, Oh, it looks like me who's in first. It's like, I just don't believe it. Because there's probably someone else who looks like me. Yeah, see, Baby Park, bad. That's true. Mars, you're correct. And Neo Bowser City, good. That's absolutely... Yeah, exactly. Wait, Robo, what is your least favorite track? Do you even know? I'm you, but shadier? Alright. Not cooliest, or just shadier. Nutella kicked you out and now the server is full. Either people are need to are gonna start needing to leave on their own, or like Can you have custom items in the tournament? Is that possible? I don't remember. But also I could just restart the lobby. Maybe Mario Kart 9 will get and they'll add like more than 12. That would be. I don't even know if that would be good. However, if they make much bigger tracks and add 200cc, I could kind of see that.
Oh my god, please break, 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 break. Not much! Uh. Mario Kart 9 should have 30 plus? I'd go with 32. You know, it's a nice, uh, easy, uh, power of two number. Or just go full on 64, why not? Oh, can I survive? Someone's gonna fall off, right? By their own accord? No? No one? Oh my god, just don't get hit, just don't get hit, just don't get hit, please. What is happening out there? Nintendo can barely handle 12 people online sometimes. I mean, at least this game is so delayed when you hit someone. But at least everyone's kind of here, I guess. Uh, Chris with the first. I'll take second. Insidious with the third. <laughs> Chris, stop throwing shells backwards. That's That's what you're supposed to do. The things that suck playing Mario Kart is when you're in first, everyone aims their shells at you. Well, of course they do. Or if you're Toad, for some reason. I don't understand it. Why would they do such a... Such a thing. Corey, you've been in Tricolor a lot, you think, uh, and think... Or, and you think it's guaranteed to play on instead of it being random? Wait, what, what is guaranteed to play on? I mean, it should be random, right? Whoever's going to be in the middle or the sides. Isn't that what they changed? Because Toad is the worst? No, he says he's the best. That's canon. He, he said that's a... That's a line he says. He's not the worst. Oh, you can't see the thing. There you go. Yeah, you spelled you spelled Daisy wrong. How could you do that? Toad. What? Oh well, doesn't this item combo look uh crazy? All right, we're gonna go with this then. Hope you like a lot of bananas, red shells, blue shells, bombs, triple mushrooms. Bullet Bill, Lightning, the plant, I guess, and a Super Horn. Oh, if they threw coin in there? Man. Didn't mean to pick the loop. How do you get those circles? Oh, this thing? It's a program I made. Because Nintendo can't be uh, asked, I guess, to make the random actually random. So I just went ahead and made my own. Wait, Wario calls everyone a cheater? Does that mean it's true? Wario's... No, don't listen to Wario. You don't have to look. Why would you listen to Mario? That's something we'd, ex we'd expect of him. Toad? Toad, on the other hand... He's Toad. Why would you not believe him? What is my opinion on all blue shells only? Blue shells only isn't too bad. I like the metagame toward the end of the race. Where it's like, alright, you don't want to be in first. I really wish there was a way to make up modes to where it's like, you have the, uh, however amount of time you've been in first, it like counts up. Think of like the shine sprite mode in battle, but like, in a race with the blue shells. That would be cool. Because then it'd, it'd give you an incentive to like, you want to be in first. But you're not going to be in first for a while. And that would be really cool. How do we get these comments on of a full room but have three extra slots? I don't know. Maybe people get disconnected, they don't realize. I 
Oh, Travis, no, the uh, randomization thing, that's all. I've developed a program that overlays over the game. That is all what I made, especially the items at the top, too. Because Nintendo has some pretty good ideas. They really do. But it's like, they, they get so close to being, like, amazing or great ideas. They're almost there. And then I gotta do something. And then I turn them into, like, amazing ideas. Yeah, I compose the random music? Yeah, sure. Uh-huh. Blue shell, no. Not today. <clears throat> or tomorrow. Hopefully. Super, how's it going? Welcome back. Friend code is in the description below, or there is a command. Feel free to join if you like. Let me know when you sent the request so I can go accept it too. <laughs> or the next day. Or the next day. Or the next day. Host advantage? Uh-oh. Wait, I don't think host means anything here. <clears throat> Like, let's be honest. I don't think I'm really... I don't think... Are we all connected to each other's game, or are you all connected to my game? And even so, it, does it, like... It doesn't even matter. It's developed by Nintendo. <clears throat> Phone call for you, Mr. Complex? Is there really? I don't know. Wait, who's... Who's calling? Actually, if I disconnect, the whole room goes down? Okay. You know what? <laughs> you might be onto something. <laughs> Listen, you think I know how these items work? Because maybe I don't. Do you mean the super horn? That item? Oh, I should save this mushroom. So glad I remembered. Oh my god, just plant- stop! This is like the- when the game first released and they allowed multiple plants everywhere. No, I wanted the- okay. Why? How does the host have any advantage if, like, Mars was able to pick up the item, uh, the double item box right in front of me? But sometimes it lags for, like, other people? That doesn't make any sense. Because that was, like, immediate. <clears throat> Alright, somehow I got into first. I'll take it. Why did I use the super horn? No. <laughs> oh no. Come on, mushroom, please. Still going for it. I'll take fourth. Why not? <clears throat> That's not bad. That could have been worse. Blue Jay, welcome to the stream. Hopefully you had a good weekend so far. Kakashi's uh, not having a good Mario Kart day. Imagine being able to see literally everything around you. And then you just don't have a good day still. Oh, come on. Really? That wasn't going to go over to mine?
Blue Jay, it's going great so far. Glad to hear. <laughs> no. No one... Don't listen. No one listen to Josh or Nutella. They don't know what they're talking about. They think it's opposite day. And that's fine, you know? But it's not. And... But now they know. Ocean, how's it going? Welcome back. Hopefully you had a good Saturday. Oh my god. You know what? I should add to my program an option for like chaotic mode and it gives like different weighted values to like some of the items where you know, there's lightning and blue shell and other things. That might be useful. Ocean, you've had a good Saturday so far. It's good to hear. Don't run into the mushrooms, please. Don't, don't do it. Why did I drift the wrong way? Come on. Oh. Can I drift at all, please, game? Alright, two of you have to hit each other up there, right? And there's another one. That's... wow. Alright. Can I get a... We secured 8th place. For Mario Kart 8. <clears throat> Nutella, you got 4th? Wow, that's... Good for you. Good for you. Why is Baby Park up there? Who would do this? Mars, you got a rock? Wait, what's the rock for? <laughs> to throw at Toad? Wait. Alright. That probably hurts a lot more than any of these items, right? Like, we're just having fun hitting each other with these items, and you're just gonna get an actual rock and throw it at me. Alright. Oh my god. Insidious. I, I would have done the same. You know what? I would have done the same. <clears throat> Tanker, how did the Rocket League stream go earlier? Terrible. The delay was terrible. I don't know why that always seems like an issue. And then people who are always on my team just like throwing temper tantrums once they're like two down and a minute left to go. I'll never understand it. Why did I throw the red shell into the wall? Why they gotta be so weak? You should have joined, you had it on your Xbox? Oh, I wasn't playing with anyone from the chat. I was playing competitive. Like, I'll probably have to just go and grind GC another time to get it back or like, uh, play it off stream.
Why does one red shell slow down so the other one can hit it? I don't, I don't understand. Yeah, Tanker, thanks for the luck. I mean, we'll see what happens. David, we're tied. Tied for second. Someone should kick Insidious from the lobby. What was that? Wait, Insidious, what did you do? You don't even know? <laughs> Insidious, you should know better. <laughs> Boombox. What is Boombox? Is Boombox the super horn? Like, I kind of feel like, did I, did I know the item by a different name this whole time? The boom box is the red box. The red box. Oh, the super horn's red, right? It says if you have to choose between you, um, you or someone else, you're always choosing you. That's not a bad answer, to be honest. I call the boombox that? I thought, it was, I thought it was called the super horn. I don't actually know now. Wait. What is that thing? How did I dodge that? What is the thing actually called? Hold on. Wait, does this game show the, the name of the items? The red horn is called the super horn? Yeah, that's what I thought. But like, now I'm doubting myself because... Uh, I mean, is it different in different languages? Oh, that was pretty well timed, except you got iframes, but I was able to pass that in time. Why did I throw that in front of me? All right, I'll take it. Brady, welcome to the stream. Hopefully you had a good weekend so far. I do apologize, but I don't allow anyone to Treat my chat like a um, billboard. So I apologize for that. Also, I'm probably the worst person to ask. I don't I don't do any self promotion of like myself or anything. So the yeah, I'm probably not gonna be the best of advice. There's a lot of videos out there that, you know, probably give better tips or something, but I just I don't worry about it personally. Nutella, have a good one. Thanks for stopping by. Is it pronounced Tuan? If not, I do apologize. But welcome to the stream. Hopefully you also had a good weekend so far. Yeah, the blue shell blocker thing. Is that also called a blue shell or is that a spiny shell? I don't even know. But it's called the super horn, right? Okay. Yeah, I mean, boombox fits too. It's like a sound wave. That's why I was kind of like questioning myself like, wait... I mean, it could be called that. I don't know. <laughs> oh, the super horn sometimes referred to as the boom box. Why is it called? Why does it have two names? Also, boom box seems so much better suited for it. Oh, 
Oh, I keep forgetting there's like a bottom part that's better, but you know what? I don't care. Also, how am I this far ahead to like not get that psycho anymore? It has a Nintendo name and the fan name. Oh, is the fan name that? Have people dedicated it to the not right name that much? Or that's like common knowledge? That must be with like other things. No, come on. Like, I'm trying to think, do I call something that's not the right name, but, like, it's common that people call it that? That's a completely different name and not, like, a shorthand? I can't think of anything right now. Bomb buddy there. Bomb buddy there. Now I get hit by a red shell. Great. That's why I wasn't going to drop the other one. Oh, there's a blue shell. My favorite. And I was just chilling in first for so long and then not. Wow. Unbelievable. I'll take first, though. <laughs> You're welcome for the blue shell. You couldn't have waited, like, two more seconds. Or I couldn't have gotten a super horn. I'll take first, though. Fine. Gold trophy. That's mine. David was second. Lee with third. Yeah, Insidious. I was thinking about Green Mario, but, like... That, at least, is an apt description in my mind versus, like... Well, I guess Boombox is, but, like... I don't know. That's... Uh, that's not like... No one else d does that, right? Everyone just somehow keeps calling Green Mario Luigi like he has another name? Like, what? It's crazy. I don't know how wh where people come up with this stuff. You got a bug where you're flying in the lightning strike and you're still flying? No, that's patched, uh, I think, when the new item customization came out. It's kind of lame because it would have been great for, like, lightning to be more prominent, but, uh, no, they, um, fixed, or I guess patched it. I don't know if it was a problem with the game necessarily, but, yeah, you keep flying if you get struck now. Isn't Peach's name Princess, uh, Toadstool? Uh, it's also, I know from SM64, it's signed Peach. I don't know if that was changed beforehand or not. But I mean, at least for the past 20 plus years, Nintendo has also used Peach. I don't really know that much lore with everything Nintendo or Mario related, but I do know that. Speed run that game enough to where you have to listen to the intro every single time. They couldn't. They, they got so much right into, like, 3D, except just, uh, you know, let us skip the intro there. Oh, anyway. What do we have in this Legend of Zelda chest? What do we got? No compass, no map, hopefully. Okay, lightning bullet bill. Nice. Always fun. The intro must be very important. It's like, come on, we're wasting time here. Like, I'm Mario. I need to save you, defeat Bowser. Like, what are we doing here? What's this message I'm getting? Mad, welcome back. Hopefully you had a good Saturday. What's the most underrated track in the game? I don't know. I don't know what tracks are popular or not. Stream idea, Mario Odyssey speedrun. Josh, do you know how wild those speed runs are I I mean, yeah I do that every year yeah at the anniversary I do a um, 
non-tech, non-speedrun tech speedrun of Odyssey. I get it down to like three and a half hours or something, right? But uh, no, I'd rather keep doing SM64 speedruns. Zero star is just, zero and single star is just so much fun. When is the anniversary? Uh, October or something? October 27th? Sure, there you go. And do a no capture speed run? Those are the most wild. You throw Cappy like downward through the floor of the game in Metro City and somehow you capture something super far away. It's like, I just, I'm not about to try and spend hours learning that. I spend enough time learning SPLJ. If I were actually interested in speedrunning speed running another game, it might be, uh, maybe OOT. That stuff seems kind of fun. And I think mainly because it would open a lot of doors for, like, randomizing. And speaking of randomizing, I should see if, uh, I know SM64 has something like that. Oh, not today, blooper. Not today. Why can't the super horn get rid of the bloopers? That'd be neat. I feel like that would kind of make sense, you know? The super horn is an air horn, not an ink horn. All right, uh, do you wanna, so how, how does that make sense that I get rid of a blue shell with an air horn? How, how does that make sense? Stream idea, baby park only Mario Kart stream. I can't enforce that. Some of these custom items would be a lot better if it was like all green shells, all bananas, and I could choose the track. But that's not possible. Like a lot of the classic uh, first Mario Kart and maybe some of the uh, GBA levels would be a lot more fun if I can enforce them with a specific item combo. The strong vibration of the air breaks them. All right, so how do I break a blue shell with the strong vibrations in the air, but I can't break a blooper? <laughs> how? Okay, what? So, like, what? Explain that. Oh, Insidious, you, you got me good there. All right. You got me good fell in the water and everything. It was game over. If anything, the air would make the ink uh, worse getting all over the place. The air would make the... Right, what does that have to do with uh, something that can destroy a blue shell not being able to destroy a, a blooper? Wait, what, is, what does that have to do with it? I mean, a plant easily defeats the blooper. Plant can't defeat a blue shell. I can't we're do Listen, we need to get to the bottom of this, alright? What's the science behind this? Where's Matt Pat? 
Where's Bill Nye? Get them on the phone. We need answers. Oh my god, can I please just not get hit by a giant bullet? Named Killer? Uh. Alright, there we go. That was it? That was three laps? Oh my god, it's, that was terrible. Oh, that was just absolutely atrocious. Third place. Tank, are you sure Matt Pat has made videos on Mario Kart 8? Yeah, probably. Because a blooper is a living squid? Why does that matter? Patrick, welcome back. Hopefully you had a good Saturday. And the shell is a fragile item? Uh... I don't what I is it though? The green shell keeps bouncing off of walls. Tankery made one four years ago thinking about how deadly the blue shell is. Oh. Yeah, I used to be all about watching Matt Pat, but man, it's just uh, I don't know. I... A lot of the questions he asks, it's like Why not just ask the dev? Like <laughs> One of those kind of things, and I'm just like... Alright, well, here we are with a 30-minute video that is now somewhat entertaining, I guess. Patrick, a missing child got... got loose? And you had to help find him? Uh, that sounds serious. Sorry to hear. I don't really know what else I could say about that, but, uh... I mean, you should... Did I read that right? You should probably call the authorities. It was crime? Yeah, I don't... I mean, you should probably call the authorities. I don't know what else to tell you. Alexander, how's it going? Welcome to the stream. Hopefully your day's been good. Have I seen the funny YouTube Mario Kart 8 Deluxe Blue Shell only videos? I've seen the thumbnails, but I don't really care enough to watch them. I can imagine what happens. Why did I throw that? Oh my god, please don't hit me. I don't think I've seen them on my main channel, but I've definitely seen them on my, um... When I switched to this channel, because it's somewhat similar. It funny and crazy, those videos? Yeah, I mean, I imagine so. It's just there's a lot of other videos I gotta watch. And I can I can imagine the extent of how a whole bunch of blue shells hit someone. I really need a green shell for this. Or do I? Dang, that was a terrible aim. <laughs> the blue shells at Baby Park? Yeah, I can imagine it. Sean, how's it going? Welcome to the stream. Is it pronounced Sean? I don't know if I ever asked. But regardless, hopefully you had a good weekend so far. Tanker, those were the only Mario Kart Game Theory videos he has done? Wait, really? Oh, five years ago on how Mario Kart 8 is a, is a Mario's most deadliest game? Oh. I kind of thought he could capitalize more on a lot more Mario Kart related things. He's only done like two. Sean, I'm guessing it's pronounced Sean. If not, I apologize. Cloud, how's it going? Welcome to the stream. Hopefully you had a good Saturday. Mario, you bet Toad is the most deadliest character? Probably. I mean, he's the best at the game. That's the most deadliest. We're so close. Just one more. 
So is Mario Kart my main streaming game now? I have no idea. This is just always like my default go-to. Like Splatoon is kind of like eh to me. Rocket League is... I mean that's like... That's a 50-50 toss-up. What else do I stream? <laughs> His next vid 10 years after Mario Kart 8's release, Purgatory? Wait, has he done a lot of like Purgatory related things? Am I planning on seeing the Super Mario movie that comes out? Uh, yeah, probably. It's probably going to be a pretty decent movie, except for the fact that Chris Pratt doesn't know how to sound like Mario. But, I mean, Luigi doesn't sound that bad. I'm fine with that. Mario's the only one that's kind of like the uh, oddity there. Oh, Sean, Saturdays are your favorite day of the weekend? Not Friday? Friday's pretty nice. But maybe that doesn't... Maybe that's not considered like a weekend. Can I get one of those bullet bills? Please? Anyone sharing? Oh my god, there's like so many people with me. Oh, one of these has to be it. There it is. I think I passed one person. Also, Josh, a lot of Mario Kart has been recently because I've made this really cool thing you may have seen as the... Mario Kart Randomizer? That's what I named it? Yeah, the circle thing. Sean, certainly Friday is cool, and you know, Saturday is good for you, uh, oh, for your special or lucky day. All right. <clears throat> Mars, every time Chris Pratt is in the movie, you hear Emmett from the Lego movie? Yeah, same. It's just like, why? I mean, does he not know how to sound like Mario or like, is this just all a ruse? Is this just like, is he trolling? Like what's happening? All the other languages dubbed over are just like so much better. Well, whatever. Maybe, you know, Nintendo thought like, Ah, he's a popular guy. The kids love him. And they're not gonna care about him not sounding like Mario. They're kids. They probably weren't even alive back in, uh, I don't know, before 2010. <laughs> so what's it matter, I guess? Unch, how's it going? Welcome to the stream. Brooke, welcome. Hopefully you had a good, hopefully you both had a good weekend. Oh no, the double bloop. Deadly. Deadly combo. Have I tried to do bombs? Yeah, I've done every item by itself many times already. However, I can't force people to choose a track, so we might not get a good track for, like, that one item. But I'm not gonna, you know, I'm not gonna force people to do something that they're not forced to do in the game, because I'm not gonna argue with that. It's not an option for me to enforce, so it's just... I'm not gonna worry about it. I'm not gonna sit here and yell at people, like... If I did say choose that track, though, I'm pretty sure everyone probably would, but... You know, I'm not, I'm not gonna... That's not... I can't do that. <laughs> How's my Saturday? It wasn't too bad. Argued with my computer about some program stuff and then, uh... And now I'm doing this?
Brooke, have a good one. Thanks for stopping by. Why was that so delayed? I look back after I pass the finish line like, wait, is there another lap? Do I still have to play? Is there not music that happens here? Who won the argument? Uh, me, I guess, you know, well, the program's not really doing much, but you know, we'll go with that. And Tanker, I don't know, I don't, you know, I don't know if I'm going to extend my, uh, it's just a game kind of thing to really think more on this. But I'm not going to dive that deep into Mario Kart lore. It, you know, it's just a game. <laughs> Wait, Brooke, I thought you said you had to go. I'm confused. Is there Mario Kart lore? If there's a video game, you could probably just go ahead and safely say there's probably lore, at least. Goris, welcome back. Hopefully you had a good Saturday. Alexander, what are my favorite Mario Kart tracks from Mario Kart Double... I'd have to see a list of Double Dash tracks. I can't just... I can't just, like, think of them. I need to see a thumbnail, and then I'm like, oh yeah, that one. Like, I just, I can't kind of come up with them in my brain. Mario Kart Double Dash came out in 03. You don't have to say that. Wait, what prompted you to just say that? Double Dash came out in 2003. Hey, did you know? That Double Dash. You know, that Mario Kart game on the GameCube came out 20 years ago. By the way, did you know that? Double Dash? That game? That sounds right. Sorry, you're just saying. Oh no, don't take anything I, I say seriously. I was just going along with the bit on how like old I am. I'm only getting older. Oh, that was a good jump. How does Toad do it? It's because he's the best. That's how. Yeah, Mars anything could pretty much have lore. Tanker, you always wonder if Mario Kart is just an alternate universe of Mario with the same... Or with the other Mario side games that are... Are they even canon? See, I think about that and then I just don't. Because it's like... I don't suspend my disbelief enough to... Really care. Just everyone pass me. Why not? Alexander, you're born on, uh, April Fool's Day. Not joking. Okay. I mean, that's cool, I guess. Alright, I'll take third place. Insidious with first, David with second. I will take bronze or copper. Does that look like copper more or bronze? I don't even know. <laughs> I was born not joking. Are you joking? Could you be joking about the joking? How long am I streaming for? I don't know. I just... I need to not think about programming for at least a few hours. The odds you believe to be born on that day is 365 to 1. I don't know if that's true. I think statistically speaking, there is a... Some days probably have a higher likelihood than other days, right? There's no way out of all 365 days of the year that it is a almost even uh, one out of 365. Probably not.
Lunar Iceberg? Oh, the Iceberg videos. Those are a thing, right? Alexander, you're not joking uh, on the birth date? I don't think anyone was thinking you were. <laughs> Renata, you just checked you have the space parka. That's good for you. Uh, I'm probably never going to play the game again because, again, there's just no endgame that I care about. In cities, were you born? Are you a program? Is Luigi the best Mario character? These are important questions. I mean, he's not, but, you know, I guess some of us could dream, right? Alexander, at least you weren't born on New Year's? Is that, like, bad? I don't know if there's, like, a bad date to be born. Imagine being born on leap year, you age slowly. Yeah, that's how that works. Totally. They'll uh, they'll get to 20 and just be like, why am I all of a sudden looking 80? <laughs> oh, I guess if you're born around Christmas or something, you'll get like less presents. I could kind of see that. But I have I have no experience of that. And I could say something a little uh I don't think it'd be dark, but like I won't. <laughs> Protect me, bomb buddy. Do your best. Oh, I threw you off the game. Oh my god. That bomb buddy just got deleted. Didn't die by the blue shell, though. I don't know what it is about this turn, but I just, I can't. Oh, and Insidious, you're just gonna pass me. I'm gonna get hit by a red shell. Alright, what's the next thing to hit me? Nothing. Which Persona game is my favorite? Uh, I've never played Persona. I played... The only Persona game I played is the fighting one. I'm not... I'm not gonna play a game where you have to do a whole lot of, like, talking with other NPCs or, like, any of that. Like, the combat seems interesting, but, like, you have to do so much other stuff. I can't be bothered. I just can't. It's like, it reminds me of Fire Emblem. It's like, there's some pretty fun tactics in Fire Emblem, but then it's all of a sudden, like... All right, you're a teacher, you're teaching your students, uh, hang out with them. I don't know, give them grades or something, tell them they're doing fine in life, and it's just like... What happened to the gameplay? Where did it go? And it's, it's just gone. People born on February 29th, 2016 are technically two years old. Is that true? I thought a year could technically be considered how many days you are old. So, like, you're technically 365.25 times 8 years old at that point, right? <laughs> DM me what you're gonna say, you gotta know. Insidious, it would be about divorce. <laughs> I'll say that. I wasn't gonna bring up unalive dates. <laughs> no. Mars, every time you can't wait uh, to fight every time in Persona 5, the dialogue takes too long. Yeah, dialogue, like, you know, that game's very heavily, like, is story-based the right way to say it? I guess it is. I don't know. I just don't care for all that. If it was, like, a show, that would be so much better. Oh my 
my god, why? These walls. Alright, who ran into me? Why would you do that to Toad? He deserves none of this bullying. Alexander, did I notice that someone stole my bomb? Yeah, I noticed some things that happened in the game. Alright. I should be noticing more. There we go. I hope I zap someone. Did I notice that I fell into the wrong- the wrong water? <laughs> yeah, it wasn't the right water that time. Nor the left. It was the wrong. Tell you what time it is? Uh, I mean, there should be a clock somewhere. I'm not gonna be able to guess what time zone you could be in. It ended as the lightning hit. I still wanted to use it and hope I got someone, alright? Heather, how's it going? Welcome back. Hopefully you had a good weekend so far. Okay, sorry. You don't have to apologize for... ...me to not want to tell you what time it is because that's a very odd thing to ask. Like, how, how am I supposed to know? <laughs> like, you could be anywhere on the planet. I'm not gonna know what time it is for you. Also, usually people watch this on a device that has a clock somewhere. How did I miss it? I can't believe this. Is it just like... Is the hitbox smaller? Did they change it? How am I missing the items? I'm gonna keep this one, just in case. Toad has a smaller hitbox? Yeah, but I've always been using Toad. I mean, like, recently. Cool. I will say, the very beginning of this map is very fun. I don't know what it is, but that turn... The left turns there are a lot of fun. <laughs> Mars, you had a bomb? Are you kidding me? Oh my god, I almost ran into Chris's. Alright, excuse me, coming through. Don't mind me. I'm just a toad. Wow. I can't believe you got me in the middle of that shortcut. I think we're good. Oh, we're good. Oh, we're not that good. Oh, we're still way behind. What happened? What race did that happen in? Mars, you see what I mean by the first curves are so fun? They are! It's just that left turn, it just works. And then honestly, the two, um, 
turns where you like cross a wooden bridge, but you don't get a jump off of it where you could just immediately start drifting and you'll stay on the terrain. That's honestly a lot of fun too. Super, have a good one. Thanks for stopping by. And JS, how's it going? Welcome back. Hopefully you had a good weekend so far. You also really like the half pipe? The half pipe's a little iffy for me. I feel like most of the time I just need to like always be holding right. Or no, left, because I'll go too far right, but then sometimes I won't go all the way left and then I'll be... Or no, I won't go all the way right, I'll be holding too far left and I'll just fall off the map. Tatsu, you've, you've returned to the lobby. Well, welcome back to uh, the battlefield. I hope everyone enjoys that bomb I left behind. You're welcome. Should have been prepared. And JSUR, apparently RE8 is coming much earlier. That's good to hear. You stole both of my bombs. Back to back, why? Alright, I got a third. Wait, can you not steal if you have it held out? Is that a thing? That's not a thing, is it? Do I play Roblox? I do not. I have no interest in Roblox. I'll say the thing I always say about Roblox. Why play games in Roblox when you can play the actual game? Okay, wow. Is it- what is it in this item thing? Is it just bombs? There's more items! It's just bombs. Oh, JS is coming tomorrow. That seems pretty early. Oh, so you got a Diet Coke with you? Alright. As do I. Diet Coke's pretty good. Only need bombs? Apparently. And mushrooms. Best to drink? It's pretty good. It's up there. It's a nice soda to where I think I could just endlessly drink it and still be fine. And I'll take that. What is my favorite drink? Uh... Favorite drink? Starbucks. Midnight Mint Mocha Frappuccino. And it doesn't exist anymore! <sighs> Petition for Lunar to stream Roblox? I just- I- it doesn't look appealing at all. I don't get the appeal. The only appeal I could get with that game is collecting items that are discontinued. But, I already do that in RuneScape. Why? I'm not going to worry about another game. Not going to do it. Also, the demographic is probably like, you know, less than half of my age. I don't want to deal with that. Are you kidding me? Insidious, I had you until, you until I said mint. But have you seen how good it looks? It looks amazing. Roblox is a meme game you play ironically. Yeah, but like, I, I just, I'd rather play something else ironically. Like, instead of Fall Guys, I'd play Stumble Guys or whatever it's called. You never searched it up? Oh, dude, the Midnight Mint Mocha Frappuccino looks beautiful. Is it pronounced Mew? If not, I do apologize. Welcome to the stream. Hopefully you had a good weekend so far. And if you want to join, feel free. It's open for anyone to join. Just a uh, friend code thing in the description. Do I play Minecraft? I'll go through like breaks of Minecraft and then just no life Minecraft for a good solid week or two. But mainly modded Minecraft. Vanilla Minecraft is just, there's nothing to do anymore. I've done everything. 
I've collected every single possible item. There's just nothing else to do. And Josh, pumpkin ain't bad, but I prefer a lot of other flavors as opposed to pumpkin. And Alexander, I'll just safely say probably the next wave will come out a third into the year, right? Or a fourth, because there are three waves left. So one will probably come out sometime between month three and five, the next one between, I don't know, like seven and nine, and the last one maybe like 11 or something. Pixelmon is fire. Pixelmon seemed interesting. Honestly, I'd probably rather play that than play, like, uh, their mainline games. But... I don't know. If I played Pokemon, I'd rather keep it in Pokemon. Although I wouldn't want to play it now. Before, I'd rather keep it in Pokemon. It is pretty cool. You could immediately just ride Pokemon in Pixelmon, though. Like, it's just... That makes sense. Was that the last race? Do we have another one? If I play with bots, uh, I'm always first. What game is this? Also, why, why play with bots? What are we talking about? What's happening? Mars, you might complete Pokemon Sapphire instead of buying Scarlet or Violet. Yeah, I mean, I'd recommend that, honestly. Like, sure, the style of, like, older Pokemon is just kind of, like, a product of the time it was built and designed in. But they did the most they could with that, like, limitation. Now, it's like they're just taking the reverse of that. Like, what's the least we could do with the Switch? And it's like, why do we have just this garbage? I don't understand. <laughs> Oh, three more races? Oh, okay, I'm way off. Alexander, I have no idea what that game is. Although I don't really play a lot of, like, phone games or anything like that. Oh, this is the final race, okay. Oh, it's a cheap knockoff of Pokemon? I'd probably rather play, like, uh, the more ROM-hacky Pokemon games. Like Coralmon or, um... Crystal clear or something like that. However, I did play a little bit of Rick and Morty's uh, Pocket Mortys. That was fun. That was pretty simple. I didn't mind that. It's also for the PS4 and Switch. Yeah, I don't know if I'd actually dedicate time to play Pokemon Knockoff. It's sad to think that I just want to play Pokemon, like a good Pokemon game. Like, I'll play a spiritual successor to Sonic. I don't know if I could do that for Pokemon, because there's still a chance in Pokemon to have Pokemon I like, like Ampharos. I'm not going to have that in, like, knockoffs that can't infringe on Nintendo's copyright. It might be that. Maybe. Oh, you know, I have a good one. Thanks for stopping by. Also, the non mainline games are still pretty solid. Like, Arceus was good. Let's go, we're good. I need Let's Go Johto. Like, please, Nintendo. I just, I want that game so badly. Oh, it was 35? Okay.
Tatsu. Oh my god, what is. Can I just. I can't get an item. I'm gonna get bullied out of the way. Then someone's gonna hit me with a completely random different item. And then I'm gonna get seventh. <sighs> Mew, you bought Arceus right before you got really sick, and now uh, you can't look at the game without feeling sick. Ooh. That's not good. It's a really solid game for the gameplay, though. JS, you thought Sun was uh, pretty cool, but that's because you beat it in 8th or ninth grade, so, you know, your opinion might change after a replay. The problem with 7th gen is... In a sec. Insidious with the first, Gorsk with second, Chris with third. Lunar with fourth, by the way. Nobody asked. But I, wa I was not fifth, alright? I was so close to a trophy. Also, we've had some really good item sets in the past little bit. Like, there's been some wild items. Anyway. 7th gen, Sun and Moon. Didn't like the format. They, it's just, it was terrible. I, you go to islands, there's no gyms. You have some Z-move dancing kind of thing. I just, I just couldn't. I couldn't deal with it. They finally went back to a more standard, traditional format for 8th gen. But man, was it at least better than 9th gen. But like, it's just, it's just, it's get, it gets worse. It's just, it's, I don't know what Game Freak is thinking. It's just sad. I don't know what language that is, but welcome to the stream. Hopefully you had a good weekend as well so far. Like, I bought Moon. I was at the midnight release for Moon. And then got to the second island and I was like, this isn't anything like a Pokemon game. I'm done. Who was that lame in fourth? Uh, we will just never know. It could have been anyone. <laughs> Could have been anyone, Insidious. What? Anyway, uh, the new item set. I wonder what it's gonna be. <laughs> it's another wild one. Or at least I think. It's like lightning, blue shell, bullet bill, plant. I mean, that's... These are great. Also, singles for like the banana and two shells. Sun and Moon felt like a Pokemon clone. It's just like, oh, and then don't even get me started on like the, the Sun and Moon seemed like what I didn't like 4th Gen for. It's like, let's just go crazy with some of the end Pokemon. Let's just throw in legendaries, mythics, whatever they're called, things, and then like Ultra Beasts, what are those? I don't even, I don't, I don't know. They, they just got wild. Would I ever do battle mode in Mario Kart? Uh, maybe every once in a very long while. I don't care for battle mode. I play Mario Kart for the kart racing. Mario's you replayed Sun multiple times. You don't think you will, again, much rather play X and Y? Yeah, like, I think 6th Gen was, like, the final good Pokemon game for me. Not style-wise. I would probably much prefer 5th. 5th was just such a good step into, like, keeping... The game, the same stuff. Why are we here? Well, who's done this? Who, who is this? What is my most played Switch game? I'm pretty sure it's this. Not this stage. This game. In cities, you would honestly prefer that uh, to what we have now. Nothing until an inevitable, inevitable paid DLC. Also, yeah, there's that. Man, remember back in the day? Kids these days, they won't understand. But like, mystery gifts and everything? What happened to that? Is that just now DLC we have to buy? And we don't even get to go to an event? Or something? Man. What happened? Isaiah, congrats. Have I ever unlocked Gold Mario? Yeah, I've unlocked everything in the game. Triple Star, uh, all the ghosts. Uh, is there anything else? I haven't done any of that stuff for the newest maps, though. Oh, that was the it. Or that was the end.
In Pokemon Sun and Moon, they have Ultra Beasts. The Ultra Beasts are supposed to be stronger than your average legendary Pokemon. Yeah, I mean, I just, like, what are they doing? Like, it's just, it seems ridiculous to me. I mean, valid. Some of them look cool, but... I don't know. I, I never liked Megas either because it's like not er, every Pokemon, every final evolution or single evolved only Pokemon should have gotten a Mega. And then like, it doesn't matter now. They're just going to change it to a different format. So it's like, why should I care about any of that? It's like, oh, maybe for battling. Oh, you mean some of the random seeds they actually, they actually didn't program correctly for online in ninth gen? Or, like, maybe I should just not waste thousands of hours of my life and just do Showdown anyway? It's just like, why... There's nothing, like, in Pokemon for me anymore, and it's kind of sad. Unless it's the remix. Those are still good. They're still holding it up. Mars, you remember going to GameStop to get a code for a special Pokemon? Yeah, I remember I got, like, um... I don't think you had to go anywhere for, um, was it called Big Teeny? Uh, number, it wasn't number 501, right? It was, uh, 5th gen, no, that wouldn't make sense. Wait, would it? Oh no, it was a cool Pokemon you got, like, it was number 0 in the index or something like that. Can't wait for the next gimmick, Insidious. Uh, Sprite... Spriteify? It'll be something wild. Mars, they never introduced the Ultra Beast, they just threw them at you? It was like endgame content, right? Again, I never passed the second island, so... I know there's something crazy like wormholes or something, I just... I, I just, I don't understand it. We're not to have a good one, thanks for stopping by. Bullet Bill, why... DNF. I should have not used the mushroom. I should have saved it. Oh, the one that I was talking about from Unova region in Gen 5, Victini? Oh, I guess it is called Victini. Tenth to first with that jump? Oh, did I take the tenth place you had? Wow. Great. Was it tenth? Yeah. Alexander, no, I think I know what you mean. Wait, JS, which uh, 3DS do you have? Because, I mean, they have, like, an XL one. Mars, you really love the Pokemon animations for 4th and 5th gen, and the moving sprites are amazing. And JS, you have the original? Oh, the original one was definitely pretty small. Tatsu Gen 9 frustrates you. Uh, that's the most fun you've had in a Pokemon game in spite of all of its problems. Wait, ninth gen? Wait, what? What specifically is fun? Oh, seventh to first. Not that bad. Oh, the next gimmick has got to be sprite variations of the models. Oh man. It's another time-related thing, and it's just like, ah, we went back in time, but, like, they're all now 2D. Wacky new gameplay. I was gonna add on to that. I forgot what I was gonna say, though. Oh! Like, if they just made really good sprites have, like, a few animations, but maybe make them kind of move all together... Or, like, jump in place. Or, like, 
I don't know, have some editing effect on them, I'd be fine with that. As long as it acted like a Pokemon game. But they're probably never going to go back to that style because, I mean, why would they? Oh, Alexander, I think the original 3DS I used to have was all black. I even bought the expanded battery on it. And then, uh, now I just have the new 3DS XL thing or whatever it's called. I don't even know the actual name. But I, I don't think I've turned that thing on in, like, years. You left the bomb! Wow, you shouldn't have. Heather with the back throw. Alright, okay. Oh, Insidious, that was pretty close. Oh, you're talking about the older DS models. Okay. Yeah, I can't remember what older DS model I had. And Josh, you remember when I had a, a schedule on my website? Yeah, it's, you know... It's not there. <laughs> kind of wish I had time like I want to program a new schedule that looks cool and animated and all like interactive and stuff but it's like well now I want to program this other game idea I have and that's kind of taking up my time Wait, Gorosk, were you surrounded by, uh, bullet bills? And you survived? Tatsu, you like exploring the world in Gen 9, plus the story, narrative, and characters were some of the best that you've seen in any gen? I don't know. There's no VC, and that's kind of a letdown. Uh, they have, like, mocap, it seems like, but they don't have VC. And then it seems like they put most of their effort in the end game. And then just nothing, maybe at the very beginning, but then like nothing in between. Oh wait, did I say V, uh, VA, I guess, yeah. I was thinking voice chatting, but yeah, I guess voice acting. Uh, and then, what else was I gonna say? Oh yeah, they could have made the entire world scaled down. And I feel like it would have been fine, like, I don't know how they made Arceus seem like a less empty world when maybe it was just as big and then the story I didn't care at all about the story but that's usually how I feel about Pokemon anyway I just like collecting that's it the story is never gonna be as good as uh, a story that could be a little bit darker for like a different age I can't remember what game a streamer I was watching was playing, but I think it was a sub goal he hit, and he usually collects a lot of achievements throughout the decades of playing Xbox related games, and I think he was playing some sort of Bratz game, and that game was all voice acted, and it's like, he made a joke on how like, you know, can you believe that this game is voice acted and Pokemon's not, and it's like, I mean, that's, yeah, that's, that's actually, uh, <laughs> you know, that's, that's pretty bad at this point. Gabe, how's it going? Welcome to the stream. Hopefully you had a good weekend so far. Also, if you're going to go into 3D and not have any known good styling to your game, just go all the way with voice acting. What region should Gen 10 be in Pokemon games? I have no idea. I don't think there should be new Pokemon in the in Gen 10 though. Just make a 10th Pokemon game. Add all the Pokemon literally ever in that game and then just make up a region or something. I don't know. Just have like a break point to just like have everything follow up. Honestly, there's no reason Pokemon shouldn't have VA. Yeah. I mean, if they're going to like if they stayed the same style they were for years, like 2D but like 3D-ish. Then just, like, they wouldn't need VA, but, like, if they're gonna go full into, like, 
how games are nowadays. It's kind of weird when you just hear people walk up to each other and just kind of look at each other and not say words. <laughs> Egypt or Australia? See, I don't care about like regions at all. I just want to collect the Pokemon. It could be any Americas, it could be any Europe, it could be any whatever. It doesn't. I don't. I don't care about like the location. Your critiques of Gen 9 are valid, and yet you still- Yeah, I'm not- like, I'm not gonna- I think I mentioned this before, but I don't care if people have fun doing anything. I just kinda care if they start saying like, yeah, this game was perfect, and it's like... That's just... not great. But I mean, you know... Nintendo's probably already set on making 10th Gen, and they're probably already gonna... Ruin it as much as they have, and it's probably gonna just sell so well. And the Pokemon is just gonna be like, it's just gonna get worse, and it sucks to see that. It really does. And even Magic the Gathering has been having an issue. And it's like, magic is kind of getting a little worse. Pokemon's kind of getting a little worse. I don't think Sonic Frontiers was as good as it should have been. And it's like... All I have is like, Mario and The Legend of Zelda left. As long as they can keep those games good, I still have those two games. Uh... 2022 was wild. Alexander, you keep hearing rumors about a new Switch system coming? Yeah, I mean, I hope so. Just make a better advanced Switch backwards compatible, which they'll probably do. And I wonder if the big question is, are they going to make new releases for a new Switch backwards compatible or not? That's the big question. I think that's like the only question that should really be considered. Like, if there's a Switch 2... Yeah, you're probably going to be able to play Switch 1 games on it, but like... Are they going to do with, uh, are they going to do a whole lot of the, um... Like, I think a lot of PlayStation games have always been, like, available PS5. But also to everyone who couldn't get a PS5 on the PS4. I wonder if they're going to do that. <laughs> yeah, Switch Pro can only play Switch Pro games. Shut up and give them your money. <laughs> it is Nintendo. So, I mean, <laughs> if they do that, oh man, I, <sighs> they got to profit more on a game cartridge than the system, right? So, like, I think they'd make more money if they didn't do that, but I don't know, it's Nintendo. Wait, Alexander, you don't like the new system prices? I mean, I feel like more people get... You get a lot more stuff from the, the Nintendo consoles than you do any other console, at least. And they're, like, half the price. It's like Xbox Series X. Oh, I could just play most of those titles on, like, a computer. Or a different console. Nintendo is like, ah, you kind of, you know... Somewhat have to get this, the console to play the games. Oh, it's 80 for a Zelda game? Standard edition? Is that with, like, DLC and everything? Oh, yeah, PS5s, I think, are... They're, like, easy to get, right? It's just the price that a lot of people probably can't afford. Alexander, you're gonna give me an example of one? The PS3 back in the mid-2000s, mid you say? It was about $500 back in those days. Wait, isn't your argument against the... how Nintendo's expensive? Like, as far as the three companies go... I mean, Nintendo's, like, much cheaper. They even have a cheaper yearly subscription fee. First place. 
What a terrible map. Oh, and Mew, what do you mean by three exclusives? What was that in reference to? It's an example on a price like PlayStation is doing, for example, the standard edition for Jedi Survivor 70. I don't think Breath of the Wild shouldn't be 70, right? Insidious with first, I'll take second, Heather with third. Right? Breath of the Wild. I mean, are you looking for a physical copy? That might be different because I don't know, like, if those are still, like... Oh, you're exaggerating, but the games nowadays are doing that? I mean, some games, I guess for, like, Sony and Xbox. Uh... Insidious have a good one, thanks for stopping by. But, I mean, Nintendo's just kind of always strict at 60, right? Oh, Mew, you're building off the other person's joke on the Switch Pro would only be able to play Switch Pro games. And then there's only three exclusives. Yeah, it's kind of like how there's only like one PS5 exclusive or like maybe two or something. It's like I don't plan to get it unless like there's one game I really need to or one game I really want to play on it. But I already have a PS4, so... Oh, Tanker, no, that wasn't the last uh, game for today. Alright, Lightning's in. That's not too bad. Sandy, how's it going? Welcome back. Hopefully you had a good Saturday. Or how the new 3DS only has, like, seven exclusives. Yeah, I don't think I really noticed that. Wait, I don't think... There's a lot of 3DS games I had. I mean, there's Smash, Mario Kart, Animal Crossing, 3D Land. That's four. I mean, I'd buy it only for those four, to be honest. Yort, how's it going? Welcome to the stream. Hello, bro. Is this Splatoon? Yeah, this is Splatoon. Welcome to... Uh, Yoshi's Egg... What does that say? Mario something? Yeah, it's Splatoon. Uh, yep. We're playing the racing mode today. But hopefully you had a good weekend so far. Hopefully you're doing well. Imagine the new Switch cartridges have, like, a little nub so you can't use them on the old Switch. I wouldn't put it past them. I would not. A Minecraft weapon moment. I need to know what the moment was. I can't remember. Uh. Man, it must have been real good. Josh, wouldn't I play Spider-Man 2? Not really. Spider-Man is... It's like one of those games like God of War, Infamous, uh, Fallout. Maybe not like Fallout. It's, it's a... Or like Assassin's Creed. It's too RPG, I guess. I don't know how to explain it. It's just not fun. There's not too much raw gameplay, I guess. Nutella, welcome back. I am still alive. And streaming. That joke is still not old yet. Rip the 3DS eShop? Oh, is that gone? Is it now extinct? Your, your weekend's been good. It's good to hear. Mine hasn't been too bad. I'm just now kind of stuck programming something that's gonna keep me busy for quite a while, probably. Wait, it died today? Wait, like today, today? Oh, and March will be gone? 
Oh, Mew, there are 15 new 3DS exclusives, three are eShop exclusives, most of which are probably shovelware. Yeah, I mean, I, I just remember there was like quite a bit of 3DS games I had. And I mean, you know, if there's more than five, it's probably worth it, at least for me. Oh, it isn't until March 2023? Oh, okay, yeah, there's still months left then. Oh, wait, is that gonna mark the day where Alpha Sapphire, all of my Pokemon, will be permanently on Alpha Sapphire? Like, I can't use that to go to the bank? Josh, would I return to 3D All-Stars? Uh, I don't think I have a reason to ever do that. Sunshine's a terrible game. Galaxy's not bad, but like... SM64... I mean, I speedrun that game, so I'm just gonna always keep going back to that game. Oh, it's up to Game Freak? Oh, wait, can my 3DS still connect to a bank then? That's not dependent on the shop. I mean, I'm probably never going to move all my Pokemon off of there anyway, because you can't have all the Pokemon in a Pokemon game as it is. So, like, that's the only reason I kind of really played. Have I ever played any Mario Golf games? I don't think so. If I ever played a golfing game, I would just probably default to Wii Golf. Or like one of those putt-putt or uh, mini-golf games that are, there's like a lot of them. But usually for Mario, I only stick to the platforming and racing games. All the other games, I'd probably play a different game instead of a Mario brand one. How did you get me to? Really? I got that close? Petition for Lunar to do a 3DS game stream. I don't have a modded 3DS. Also, I don't know what game I'd play. Like, 3D Land was fun. But, like... Yeah, maybe just 3D Land. Cindy, you made chocolate chip cookies. I hope you're jealous. How can I... Is that true or not? I haven't gotten a picture yet. Did I learn how to do the Boo Lake shortcut at the end? Oh, yeah. I just didn't go for it those times. Mario Golf GBA was incredibly fun. I don't think I ever played that one. Oh, you're right. Please stand by. All right. I'm not standing, but I'll be here. Petition for Mario Kart 9 to happen. I'm scared about Mario Kart 9. It's probably not going to have as many tracks. And is the new gimmick... Like, what's going to be the new gimmick? Like, what... I don't know what they could be doing next. Same with Odyssey. It's like... They better have something good. You feel like Mario Kart 8 is alright for now? I, I mean, I like it. It's fun. I wish Time Trials showed you your rank worldwide, but it doesn't. Other than that, I kind of wish the triple stars would show up online, but it doesn't. Uh, yeah, I mean, you know, I'm fine with it. Mario Golf Toadstool Tour for the Nintendo GameCube wasn't that bad. I mean, I'm not saying, like, any games are probably bad. It's just I don't... I'm not that into, like, a golf game. And it being Mario uh, style doesn't really matter to me. I, I play games for, like, the gameplay. Petition for Luna to return to Bikini Bottom rehydrated? No, absolutely not. I'm good. Do 
Jaya, speaking of games, you finished Star Wars Jedi Fallen Order. It took you two days. Hopefully it was fun. That doesn't seem like a too long of a game. Oh, it was a ghost. Oh my god, the eight I got. That was pretty great. Was that four reds and four mushrooms? Pedro, how's it going? Welcome to the stream. Hopefully you had a good weekend. Uh, careful about any, like, gibberish. I don't know what any of that means. Will I ever play Paper Mario? That's like another game where it's like, why play a Mario-styled RPG when there's probably a much better non-Mario-styled RPG out there? With the time I have, or rather time I don't have to play games. Also, I probably would play it if it was, uh, if there was any, like, VA. I'm not gonna, I'm not gonna read. At all. Can't do it. Won't do it. Why read? Watch, they'll put Chris Pratt in the RPG series, and I'll just be like, this is gonna make me not want to ever play it. Cindy, those cookies look amazing. Oh my god. Look at them. There's so many chocolate chips in the middle one. It's crazy. <laughs> Petition to stop making so many petitions. I don't know about that petition. There will probably be a game made based off of Mario... Uh, oh, the Mario movie that may have Chris Pratt. See, I don't think I'd play it. Like, I, it's just... I play Mario for platforming. That's so much fun. They're one of the best platformers out there. Side-scrolling and 3D. Alright. Oh, uh, I blame Wario. Go risk. That was your fault. I know what character you play as. Super Smash Bros. Ultimate for the Switch took you about 18 hours and a half to beat the story mode. See, I never went through with the story mode. I just... I play Smash for the fighting. Why would I play a story where they try and... You know, make up a reason for the characters to be connected. Like, I don't really care about that. I think I played a little bit of it, though. But I just, I just wanted to get into the fighting. Which has its own issues online. Local, I'm sure the fighting's incredible. But man, there's a lot of issues with it online. The story mode in the game is somewhat toward the end of it. Oh, maybe I didn't even really get to the real good part. But like, I just, I want to play Smash for the fighting. Maybe someday there'll be an arm stream? Maybe. I could do a, depending on things, a 24 hour anniversary six year stream with like all the games Friday the 13th the game man those servers are dead oh that's a game you can even play a match oh is it a game where you have to like play with people When's the six-year anniversary? It's either May 9th or 8th or 10th. Maybe not on the 10th. It's around my birthday. Alexander, I'm not sure who that is. At least by name. Wait, is the Friday the 13th game one of those games where... Not party game, but like... 
Dead by Daylight comes to mind. Like, kind of like one of those games. Or, like, you have to survive, you work together, you escape. Or you kill the boss or something like that. Oh, Slash or Survival. Compete the, complete the tasks to escape. Okay, yeah. It's like one of those. Got it. I don't imagine, I like, any, like, solo queuing that, I feel like wouldn't be the way to go. I feel like the way to play that game would be... Wait, you can't have, like, your local server? I feel like... People would just play that game, like... You know, they queue up with each other, they already know each other, and they just play the game. Josh, you put in a thousand hours? Oh my god. Hopefully it was that much fun. Uh, pinball, could you just... Thanks. Alright, that's fine. Yep. Is it pronounced, uh, Marius? If not, I do apologize. Welcome to the stream. Hopefully you had a good weekend so far. Alexander is the main boss in uh, Super Smash Brothers Brawl story mode and he was the leader of the subspace army oh yeah I played I think I played Brawl's story but I don't know why maybe it was needed or something I didn't really care about the bosses I just wanted the characters or something I can't remember Josh, you have it on, like, all consoles? Again, as long as it was fun. I guess it must have been. And JS, you're gonna stream it that next week because this upcoming Friday is Friday the 13th. Oh, that's cool. But nope, the servers are dead. So you're gonna play Fortnite instead? Then watch the film? Wait, is it not a game where you usually would queue up with, like, people you know? I don't know, it seems kind of surprising to play those games solo queue. But I guess it's nice that it has that. Your, what are you doing in second place? That can't be tolerated. Oh, you could do both with friends and other players that you don't know? Yeah, yeah I just, I kind of assumed most people would play with people they already know. Yeah, you can make your own lobby and invite your friends. I hope it doesn't require... Like, are you playing a server that they host? That the devs host? Or are you, are you starting the server playing it locally? Like, is the server... Is it like Minecraft, where you could have the server you run at your place and people connect to it? There's also AI mode. I imagine just VC with your friends is like the best way to play those games. Just scream at each other, right? No, it's like Dead by Daylight in Fortnite. Wait, you can't have your own server? What happens if no one ends up playing the game and you want to play it with a close group of friends? You actually can't play the game if they turn off the servers? That seems a little wild to me. Oh, it used to be dedicated servers, but now it's peer-to-peer? -peer? Okay, alright. I was gonna say, that's... I mean, like... Kinda sucks if, I guess, you know, no one starts playing it, and then all of a sudden you can't actually play the game. You had two red shells, a boo took one, and the other boo took the other one right after. Yeah, isn't it great? Your green shells aren't even in this item combo. What are you talking about? That was dumb. I shouldn't have tried that. It's 
Cindy, please don't do it. No, you did it anyway. And then something was stolen from me. What? Wait, Cindy, are you like a ghost? I need to get far away. I'm not going to risk anything again. Oh, girls, too bad. I have another one, but I wasted it because you didn't time your super horn, and now I'm here without any items. All right, we're good. Oh, we are not good. This is this is not this is bad. This is terrible. Oh, this is even worse. Heather, you took my item box. Some people need to hit each other. Please, someone, anyone. All right, I passed someone. <laughs> Tatsu, somehow I passed you. But no one, no one up there hit each other? Tatsu with first, Goros with second, Mars with third. I'll take fourth. Thank you very much. Oh, the green shells weren't in the combos because you dedicated them peer to peer, if that makes sense. No, I don't get it. Maybe we'll get them this time. I, I don't. I'm just lost. Oh, wait. There we go. That looks better. <laughs> Tatsu, I don't think I said that. No, that doesn't sound like me at all. Also, we're getting nothing but like... Is this the right randomizer? It is. We're getting really good combos. Like chaotic combos. Yori, you'll explain <laughs> they were dedicated to all peers. Does that make more sense? Oh, like you're gonna throw them at us, your peers? Is that... Is that the explanation of the joke? Of course, of course. Well, I mean, we didn't have green shells in the other combos, so I was, like, completely lost. Like, where are you getting green shells from? <laughs> You're just saying dumb gibberish? I mean, it really threw me off because, like, we couldn't get green shells at all in the last, uh, six races. But you probably just mean, like, generally speaking, you know? Like, ah, uh, you know, the, the green shells, they'll get you somehow. Oh, there are green shells, you just can't see them? Okay. They themselves went ghost. <laughs> Another Minecraft weapon moment. Hard to tell because I wouldn't know. Alright, I'm gonna try the bottom path here. I don't like it. I don't know how to get those items. Oh, how's the cycle gonna be for up here? Okay, not bad. There's no super horn. Uh-oh. Okay. 
Goris, did you really have a red shell immediately? Why another one, huh? Great. Just great. Oh, there's another one. No, come on. Why is there another one immediately after? Am I gonna get second? Oh my god. The green shell I threw? Really? Somehow just hit the post and then back at me? I can't believe this. <coughs> really? Dude, it was just red shell after red shell and then it's like my own green shell. Chances of that. Just trying to get rid of them, too. I got passed by Tatsu playing as Daisy. I didn't see anything. I don't believe you. King, welcome back. You just got here. You can't say... Uh, or you can't stay, so you're going to say hi and or dinner. All right, have a good one. Thanks for stopping by. Hopefully your weekend was good. Can't believe that hit the post. I had a mushroom too. Just to make sure I could like get full speed immediately. But then it's like my own green shell. I am my own peer, I guess. Hey Goros, do you have an eating window? What happens outside the window if you don't eat? Or if you eat, I mean. Wait, yeah. Oh, that didn't stop anyone. You had a red shell? Really? Alright. Oh my god. Who's throwing these at? Cindy, is that you? Someone had like triple greens and they wanted me dead. Too bad. I think I got you back. like nothing I could do. Oh, okay. Iframes? Nice. Alright. Oh my god, the bullet built through the lightning with a blue shell. I'll take first though. Look at that. Number two. Who did that blue shell go after? Not me. <laughs> Cindy, those were indeed your green shells? Yeah, I had to return you all three of those. Uh, I hope you found them successfully. <laughs> go, go risk if you eat outside your eating window, you'll explode. All right, well, it's good luck. <laughs> go risk gets his food from the eating window. Actually a window. Not like, uh, I don't know, uh, a length of time between two different times. Like an actual physical window, it opens and closes. 
But apparently intermittent fasting is really healthy, so you've been doing that for a while now. Yeah, I've heard that. Like, don't eat after a certain time, blah blah blah. I've only been like... What have I been doing? Taking, like, sugar out of my diet, pretty much. And that seemed to, like, have been doing a lot for my weight, at least, so... There is that. Hey, JS, Michael Myers is one of your favorite horror icons. I mean, it seems pretty cool. I don't really know much anything about, like, those characters, though. Like, Freddy, Jason, Michael. I know of them, but, like... I don't really know much about them. I've seen some movies. They're pretty neat. I like Jigsaw. Does that count? Or is that just gore? I don't know if that's horror. Oh, yeah, he does? Yeah, Jigsaw is pretty cool. That had, like, more going on, I think, than just, like, relentless trying to find someone or something. Also, Chucky. Oh, yeah, Chucky. Okay. Why did I think that was a coin? Goris, could you really fall into the water? How? I threw that red shell probably days ago. What? Mars is a drive through window. <laughs> you can ask for anything. Oh, Goroska Penguin was at the right angle. Oh, okay. Alright. That's why it didn't seem like it stalled you that much, I guess. It was literally right at the edge of that ice. Of the ice. I don't know. It seems like you're putting a lot of blame on the, uh, the cute, adorable penguin. Who's really at fault here? Oh, your, is that your grandmother playing the game? Good old grandma? Yeah, a penguin wouldn't do that. <laughs> Penguins are too nice. All you know is that the, uh, is that killer whales are your new favorite animal? Okay, I'm sure they'll be much better. Also, Cindy. What a choice. Why this one? There's so many tracks. Matter of fact, there's more tracks than there's ever been in this game. Nice? This is not nice. This is the opposite of nice. This is mean. <laughs> what is the opposite of nice? <laughs> there's, a, there's gotta be. An opposite word than unnice. Hey, JS, why is Granny here at Baby Park? I I don't know. The nothing here makes sense anymore. Come on, where's the bullet bill? Can I please just get one bullet bill? That's all I need, game. Nope, these are green shells. Mushroom might help. Alright, I'll take fifth. We need Mad Pat for the baby park lore. You know, I think I won't watch that because it's probably bad. Cindy, you got first? How did anyone make it out of that alive?
Oh, Baby Park came from FNAF. Okay, sure it did. Right. That's probably like the super extended lore that is totally true and not made up on the spot. Darth Vader came in with uh, Voldemort and took over. Okay, yeah, I've wow, I've been, I've been not paying attention to the movies or books at all. All right, at least I got an item. People better back off. Toad's got a bomb. He'll use it. He's not scared. Why are there multiple red shells? That's not fun. Why is there a blue shell? There's only thing, one thing I have to do. That did not work out as well as I thought. What are my thoughts on grandma so far? Uh, I don't really think I have any right now. I haven't been paying that much attention, honestly. To the lore of it all. Wait, who flattened me? How dare you. Look at how upset he is. Grandma really loves Bowser. Okay, there you go. I don't realize he isn't the best after all. No, the game is just uh, rigged. It's not, you know, it's it's like broken, right? It's a Nintendo game. That's to be expected these days. All right, that makes sense. Toad's just upset. How could they make such a broken game? Weird. Nintendo broken? No. Pretty sure game I hit it right, but okay. I didn't get an item? Why did I do that wrong? Oh, it was so close. No, the banana actually did work. Oh, thank God there's another blue shell. Take that. Excuse me, coming through. <laughs> just hearing like why and then just destroyed by a vehicle why does everyone have like double reds what like come on speaking of which
all the iframes. Oh no, there's a red shell. We're good. See, Toad is the best. No problems. None at all. Somehow he's not in first, though, overall. <laughs> oh, that was the final one. Go risk. Good job on getting first place. I'll take second. Cindy with, uh, you got third. Hooray! All right. Time for another. Who got first? Oh man, I immediately forget every single thing that is happening. Anyway, moving on. This may be the last one of the night. When was the last time I got first? I got first like earlier today, multiple times. Last time I got first. You like to think baby park for your third place? Baby Park. Alright, the only interesting item here I think is going to be the lightning. Coin may be annoying for firsts. What? <laughs> Go risky. You really clipped it that fast? Oh my god, dude. I've said it before. Why are there four... Guys, you can't... This is not great. I want to have a nice, fun... Wait, we might get Cloud Top. There it is. Not even close. Not even close. Lame? No, this is... This is not lame. This is Cloud Top. This map is so much fun. Next time? Don't, no. Don't. Uh. Oh, lightning's in this. That's like the only annoying thing. It's like, I just want to have a fun, calm... Nice race in the clouds. And not Baby Park. Is that so much to ask for? How do I get the big boost in the beginning? Uh, I just toggle it right before Locky 2 throws his arm down. Or I guess as he does that. I just hold A for the entire time. Or acceleration, whatever button it is. I think B, technically. Oh wait, is it B? No, maybe X? No, Y? I don't know what button it is. Oh, maybe it is actually why. Because I just hit B to break. Oh yeah, that is the acceleration button. I remember now, because I do time trials. And you have to actually accelerate. Whatever the left button is. Which should be X. But I think Nintendo calls it Y because they don't they forgot what axes what axes are which. It was the A button to start the power up? I don't think I ever used the A button. That's too far away. I think my thumb hovers over, like, the B button and the Y button. Like, how am I supposed to accelerate and brake at the same time? That's much harder to do with your thumb if the buttons are, like, over and not already under your thumb. Your Cindy tells you that um, I'm a big fan of blue Takis. All right. Pretty sure she didn't, but you're saying she did. 
You already know. Dude, Blue Talkies advertisement on the package, they lied to me, all right? It looked like the whole thing was coated in blue. I buy a bag and I'm like, oh, look at these. These are cool. Open it. It's like, were they even trying? What is this? That's how it went. That was my experience. All right, what button do I actually press here for go? Pretty sure it's the Y button. Yeah, it's the Y button. Bag says may or may not be blue. It's just not blue enough. It's wild. Mad you're trying to find a combo that doesn't, uh, oh, that doesn't turn like crud? Any suggestions? I know nothing. I just stick with the combo I've had and I'm used to it. You could always go with, like, the meta combos. Just look at anyone who's at the top, like, VR in the game. You're, you had a, uh... You had a party and one of the bowls of food just had... Or was just blue Takis? Yeah, and they probably weren't perfectly coated all in blue. It was probably the rolled up chip and then, like... Yeah, we'll sprinkle some blue on it or something like that. Meanwhile, the red ones, that's full, that's full coated. The blue ones just look terrible. Your, how did, how did you hit me out of that? What, what happened? Ooh, karma. You'll love to see it. I'll be taking that second place, thank you very much. So I'm saying that blue Takis were just, uh, trimmed? <laughs> uh, actually the opposite. Like, I think the middles were blue, but yeah, you know. It was trimmed badly. It just didn't look like the picture. The picture looked amazing. It's like all blue. Full, full blue. And then just not. Matt, do you think Wave 4 will, will arrive uh, middle of this year? I think it'll be a lot earlier than middle. I'd say probably within the third, because there's only three waves left, and they have this year divided up by three. And Goros, they were also fit? I don't know what that means. Why out of all of the tracks? Out of all of them! Every single last one of them! All of, like... Literally all of them. <laughs> and it picks this. Very exciting? No, don't let the title of this map deceive you. It is not excite. It is unexcite. Although, wait, hold on. The first half here is actually done really well. We didn't get a large ramp there. Hold on, this, this could actually be... Decent, at best. No, this last jump here ruins it. Yeah, alright. Well, the first half is actually pretty good. If I think, if I think Nintendo is going to put all of the Rainbow Roads into the... Oh, do I think? Uh, I have no idea. I don't know what they think. I would have no reason to believe they would, uh, I don't have any evidence for that. Oh, I should have saved the mushroom. P 
People are really doing detective work for double dash tracks. All right. I mean, I'll be honest. I don't really care. Just to add in new tracks. That'd be cool. I don't really, you know, have like a um, one I would really, 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 really want to be in the game. I don't really think I care that much about it. A track's a track for the most part for me. Wait, Cindy, were you also at the party? Wait, were those actually covered in blue? What? Those don't look as bad. I need a better shot though. That's hard to tell. Matt, you determine tracks by music? Oh, I think the music's pretty good, but I don't really care about the music for like this game like I could play the music like outside the game and I'd be perfectly fine with doing that why don't I shake the Takis bag to get more of the blue stuff on them it doesn't work like that that's it's not gonna magically stick to the the chip anymore it may a little bit but like when half of it's just not coated it's like how are the red ones so coated so well and the blue ones no oh no the big blue music's amazing but i don't really pick tracks based off the music like it's amazing i listen to that like off stream like off game but like i like the gameplay mad you never played other uh, mario karts really None of the other ones? Also, I did not pick this. No, don't be deceived. I didn't do it. So I was framed. It was someone else. Also, Tanker, of course we're talking about food. This is... This is the, um... I don't know, Lunar Foodplex streams, right? Man, speaking of food, I could go for some right now. Maybe even some Takis. Non-blue ones. Because they lied to me. Oh, and thank God it's not the end of the weekend either. I could stay up late. Program a bit more, maybe. And then have more soda. Oh, this is gonna be great. Look at that. Toad, he's so happy. Although we're one point off. I chose Baby Park. I did not. It wasn't me. No, you gotta look at the... You gotta go back. Look at the evidence. It was there. I did this. I chose this. And then carefully, very carefully. Did that. Wait, your favorite Takis are the purple bag ones? They have purple ones? Could you imagine if they did? Like, my favorite chip is the purple Doritos. The sweet, chili, spicy, whatever it's called. They made those into like a Taki? Oh my god. You're, you're thinking about being a degenerate and going to CVS now to get candy and salty food? Dude, I've been having to go to the dentist like three, four times the past month. Twice after the dentist, I went immediately to CVS and got candy. <laughs> you saw the evidence? There was no evidence. What? What are you talking about? Ever bought Takis as a chip? I, what does that mean? Like, I bought Takis. They are chips. Why would I buy a singular chip? JS, you got Kit Kats? I need to... 
I, I recently just, uh, finished all of my, like, candies. And I need more. Thank God I'm going to the dentist, uh, this, uh, next Friday. I'll be able to get some more. <laughs> they made Takis into chips? Oh, into chips. Wait. They're a rolled up chip, though. I don't think I've had the unrolled up chip. I'd just rather have the chip, the, the rolled up chip. Oh, man, I don't know which uh, of the stadiums is more popular. I haven't paid attention to other people's opinions. I will say, I think I do like pinball a lot more. However, I haven't seen the time trials of either or. And maybe this one's actually pretty good. And I'm just doing it wrong this entire time. Wait, no, it's not Friday. My bad. Thursday is when I have the dentist. It's the 12th. I thought that was on a Friday. Alright. Who put the metal thing there? Why is this track so dangerous for Toad? Alexander, uh, where you live, king size Kit Kats at Walmart's, uh, is at least $2.29 for one with tax included. I guess that sounds good. I actually don't know what the price is. Josh, you went back and I picked Baby Park? I don't know. Are you trying to gaslight me? Is this the gaslighting portion of the stream now? <laughs> Oh, Garus, that's right. When are you headed there? Also, I did buy, like, a box of, like, random Japanese candy. I should do that again. That stuff was great. Most of it was great. 10% of it was, like, what in the world? But, like, 90%, pretty good. Oh, March? That's pretty cool. That is not too far away. The Takis chips, chips are Takis, but they made them to look like actual chips. Ever had those? Yeah, I don't think so. I'd, I would just have the rolled up Takis. Like, it's the same thing, just shapes differently. I don't think I'd search for, like, the triangular variant uh, Takis. I didn't even know they made them. Mad, there are two games you're hyped for this year, Atomic Heart and Dead Island 2. Dead Island sounds like a familiar title. I don't know anything about Atomic Heart, though. But hopefully they're good. Oh, nice try. Red Shell. Can't even get me. Toad, he's just too best. Matter of fact, he's three best. That's how best he is. Now there's lightning in here. All right. Alexander, you think that you're going to uh, try your luck in the next Mario Kart 8 Deluxe North America tournament? Do they have items in the tournament? This is the most iconic Mario Kart map? I have no idea if it is or isn't. I mean, it's one of my favorites, but I don't... I don't know popularity of any of the maps. I never really cared to look. Alexander, you have no clue when it is or and or what items are in it? It'd be cool if they did one with, like, no items. And all you had to... you had to pick all the same characters, so it's just skill only. Tatsu with the first, Gorisk and I tied for second place. Anyway, now that we've talked about food so much, I'm probably going to go look for some food because I'm hungry. I want food. Also, that was the end of the, the races for today.
Hopefully you all enjoyed playing some uh, Bowser Kart 8 Deluxe. Tomorrow will be, uh, I guess, just more of this. I don't really have anything else planned, so if you enjoyed this, feel free to stop by tomorrow. If not, have a great night, day, evening, breakfast, lunch, and or dinner.